Hello, I'm Mike Kinderleiter with PowerWash.com, and today I want to give you a quick demo of our new Maverick soft wash system. Most soft washing is going to be with a, uh, a sodium hypochlorite mixture, so and a lot of guys will get this in a 55 gallon drum. So what we've done is we set the system up with this pickup tube that cam locks onto the end of our inlet hose, and we'll drop this down into a, this isn't actually a drum of bleach, but if it was, it would work great. So transferring the bleach from a 55 gallon drum to a potential drum on, a, on your truck or a different holding tank, we set it up so with the switch of the valves here between going to the hose reel or to the hose for transferring, just turn the valve on, turn on our pump, gotta be ready for it. Then we take that and put it right into the our holding tank. Now we can pump this to the level we want for our blending. There's different strengths that you want to use and as you learn soft washing that's that's a different thing so if we want 10 gallons of bleach in here to create the strength we want or if we want 20 gallons we put 20 gallons in here. This barrel happens to have the gallons marked on it so we could fill to that level. <clears throat> Once we're ready we turn that off, switch our valves back. So we're ready to pull through the hose. Then we would want to add water and add our surfactant, fresh wash, which is a great surfactant for soft washing. Um, once we're at this point, then we're ready to start running the machine. So I'm going to roll the hose out here and I'm going to demo, uh, just do some quick shots here on the building behind me to show you how well the, the system sprays. And we'll go from there. So all right, let's move into the demo now. I've adjusted my valves so that I'm pulling from my holding tank to go through my hose reel. Let me turn the switch on. We'll go over here and we'll shoot on the building. And the other thing I did is I rolled the hose all the way out. This is, uh, the reason I do that is because I get better flow through my hose because it's not wound around the hose reel. I always get better flow. I'll get more distance out of my um, my, my equipment when I shoot and this is a kink resistant hose I have a two-story building here you can see I can easily get up into the eave there the two stories I get up above the two stories apply my solution I can switch between the fan tips here and I get down low. Then when I finish up the job, <clears throat> because the sodium hypochlorite can be so hard on your equipment, you want to rinse everything out. I can rinse out my hose and gun if I want real easily or I can just rinse out my pump if I'm going from one job to the next so I don't waste um, solution again disconnect from the cam fitting on our hose drop this into a five gallon bucket whoops just pull the trigger and now I can easily cycle through my pump my accumulator tank I've done most of that now, so I can turn that off. Turn this off. Now there's no more bleach left inside the pump here to um, decrease the life. It's always great. Highly, highly, highly recommend. You always rinse out your pump after every job. And at the end of the day, rinse out your entire system so that it's clear, so it's easy to move the hose from your holding tank to a fresh water supply to do that. So I hope you enjoyed our demo of the Maverick soft wash system. If you have any questions about it or anything else to do with soft washing or power washing, please give us a call at 1-800-433-2113 or you can find us on the web at www.powerwash.com. Thank you and have a successful day. When I grow up, I want to be a power washer just like my daddy. <laughs>